Hi guys, Tech James here. In this video, I'll show you guys how to install a Nintendo Switch themed lock screen for any Android device. So the link to this will be in the description. This custom theme was actually made by Mike Digicraft, so shout out to him. I'll leave his channel in the description. So if you like his work, you guys can go ahead and subscribe. So I'm just gonna open up Google Chrome right now. The link is already in. As you can see, it says, would you like to download this APK? So I'm just gonna hit okay. As soon as you enter the link in, the APK will automatically download. As you can see, it's downloaded. Don't click open, just head over to your home screen. Now you want to open something like ES File Explorer or just any APK installer. So open it, head over to your download folder, then find the APK. As you can see, it's called NS Lock Screen. You just want to tap that, then click install. You can choose package installer. Now you just want to hit install here and then hit done. Okay, so now you can just back out to your home screen. Just go onto your um, all your apps, and here you can see it is called NS Locker. So you can just tap to open it. Right, so as you can see, it's got all of these options. Um, it's got sound. You can hear the Nintendo Switch. I'm just going to turn my volume so you guys can hear it. So obviously you want to turn sound on, um, you want to turn animate switch on, and you want to turn activate lock screen on. So all of these um, all of these four options should be turned on here, and then your lock screen will be working. So I'm not sure if the screen recorder is going to pick it up, but I'm going to show you guys what it looks like on camera anyway. So I'm just going to come out of this, I'm just going to power off my device. Then I'm just going to log into it using the fingerprint sensor. As you can see it comes up, all you have to do is swipe that down and it will unlock your phone. So I think that feature is really cool. I'm going to show you guys what it looks like on camera as well. Also if you have a password on your phone, um, you know this will not bypass any kind of security. This will not bypass by passwords. You will still need to enter them after turning your phone on and off. Right, so now I'm just going to quickly show you guys what it looks like on camera. So I'm just going to turn off my phone. Now I'm just going to power it on using my fingerprint sensor. As you can see, it boots up straight away and you can just simply swipe down. And then will you boot back into your phone's home screen. So I think this is really awesome. Um, cheers for Mike Digicrafts for bringing this thing out. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one.